boy, there's a lot of stories. How, how many have you done? Oh, I don't add them up. I don't, I don't either. Know. I mean, it's, I don't know. A, a lot, lot. A lot. Many. So, <laughs> hundreds. There, yeah, hundreds and hundreds. So, wow. you know, you don't, you don't tend to sort of remember one in particular. But some are harder to get on the air. There was one just uh, less than a year ago involving uh, the murder of prostitutes. These are the least, are, are the most vulnerable people around and the least respected. And they um, uh, often come from uh, underprivileged, low-income backgrounds, and they, you know, they're the flotsam and jetsam of society. Um, and it's hard to get those stories on the air. Who's going to care about this? But there was this particular story and a particular detective who was determined to solve this crime of these prostitutes being killed. And put her own career on the line. And we figured, well, you know, we want to put our credibility on the line, too, and see if we can sell it. And eventually we did, and the show made the right decision. And it was a, it was a wonderful story to tell. It's incredibly but important to tell stories like that. It doesn't that. matter who the victim is. Right. It matters that it's a human being. And, and, and what we do to other human beings, somehow we have to figure out why we do these things and how we, you know, what, we, what we're capable of. The detective that Michael Connolly writes about, Harry Bosch, who's a fictional detective for the LAPD, his line is, when he's investigating murders, is everybody counts or nobody counts. Right. And that's how we yeah. operate as well. Um, you know, there is, I mean, everybody is somebody's kid. Everybody is somebody's brother or son or sure. boyfriend or girlfriend. And, you know, it's funny, you, you were talking about that story about, you know, prostitutes being killed and then a lot of people didn't care and then there was one guy. I, I did a story with, like, exactly those yeah. elements in Albuquerque a few years ago. Uh, yeah. And it got a huge response, despite the fact that, you know, uh, most of the women were the people that, 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 that you know, you, you, a lot of people just went by on the street and didn't pay any attention to. Yeah, and it's important to cover those stories because those who, uh, you know, murder the most vulnerable know that they're not going to. Oh get yeah, no, no. If you have a, if you have a rage reason. against women and you're and you're homicidal, they'll get in your car. I mean, they'll do the job for you. Yeah. 